so today we're on another food adventure seriously gosh people can't drive anyways sorry about that we're on our way to Karen it's an Eritrean restaurant in DC on U Street and um I'm gonna give y'all the I, like I am really trying it today this week has been hectic I'm just going through it but I'm gonna still give y'all content I'm actually not a like um I don't really eat when I'm sad type of person food just tastes weird to me I'm not really sad but it's just one of those days so this might be a little bit different than what you're used to I'm just I'm just warning y'all because I know me and it's just like I'm gonna I'm try to give y'all the best still and like my unbiased review but food just tastes, tastes weird when I'm not in a happy mood or neutral so I'm just warning y'all now but I heard so many good things about this place they have amazing Eritrean food so we're just gonna try it out I'm gonna give y'all what I can so yep come on let's go This is the menu. Whenever I go to a restaurant, I like asking the people what they like because I don't know. So we're gonna see what I do today. I think I'm gonna get this one. They named it after the restaurant, so it has to be good, but I like that ball, it's so unique. my honest review I just really felt bad like I didn't think about it usually when I go to a restaurant I do research it and like I don't know why it didn't I didn't think that Eritrean food would be similar to Ethiopian food and it's just it did not occur to me like it makes sense like Cameroon <clears throat> Cameroonians Nigerians and Ghanaian we each and Senegalese we will share them people from Sierra Leone we have a lot we have a lot of food we share in common so it makes sense for like East Africans to also have like food they shared in common but like I didn't know I didn't know so I guess you learn something new every day and I, I was not in the mood for Ethiopian food so that was a negative this is already a crappy day that so that's another negative and it's just uh, I don't know <sighs> anyways the food was good the food slaps but I think I'm gonna have to give him another try when like I feel like eating some because like there's some days where I don't even feel like eating um, 
West African food or Central African food. And today, it, it, I just wanted something light and that wasn't it. It was good, but I couldn't help but compare to the other place, which was like so much better. I don't know, so I'm gonna have to, there were a lot of stuff against this restaurant, so, which is why I wasn't really commenting in the restaurant, I was just eating, but yeah. I think I'm gonna have to give him a second chance. <sighs> well, days like this happen. All right, so I guess for the review, it has, they have a lot of stuff and the price, the price point is good and it's at a good location. But like, I won't really give you the actual food review cause just like, I was not feeling it. And yeah, <clears throat> not feeling East African food right now, so. I won't judge the food but like the vibes were good service could use some help but other than that like the price point is good so like if you want authentic East African food you can always visit them but yeah the price point is good vibes are good service could use some help but yeah that's about it sorry guys let's hope that next week is better it is October which is like one of the best months in the year so Today is October 2nd actually, so I don't know when you guys are going to get this video out, but it's October now. So yeah, let's hope next week is better. Alright guys, 